Ladies and gentlemen, today is the ride. This is the ride where we see if we can break down so we don't give it back to the customer. Basically, we're, we're the guinea pig. We gotta make sure that this sucker does not break. It's gotta be a complete product. That sun is bright. Uh, it's gotta be a complete product. No breaking down. So we'll put about 30 miles on this son of a gun. We'll do some cinematics on the way, some drone shots. Let's do it. This is the first ride. Key down here. Oh yeah, this thing lights up real sweet. Oh, check out my emergency brake. Hold that, put that in there, and then your, uh, <laughs> your bike doesn't move. Pull it out. All it is is a piece of safety wire with a little plastic thing. So, one thing that doesn't work, I really want to get this ride done um, on uh, this Sunday afternoon because there's little traffic. Sounds like we got a little squeak. Uh, the speedometer doesn't work. I need to program that. So I'll do that. I do need to get gas. I tested this uh, top speed the other day. It was, um, what was it 48 miles per hour? Probably got it got a little faster. My high beam, the light works. Blinkers, oh yeah. Other blinker, oh yeah. Horn. I don't have any uh, rear view mirrors though. I guess I could put those on. That'd probably be safe. But my uh, my uh, gas gauge works. I need to uh, definitely get some gas. I'm running out of gas right now, actually. I can see air bubbles. Luckily, there's a 7-Eleven there. Let's do this. Emergency brake off. It took a half a gallon of gas, so. We're full, yes. This road's 55. Probably shouldn't be on it, but we'll just do be on it quick. This thing rides pretty damn good for a trike. Let's do it. bumpy on the big bumps. That was pretty good though. I know the brakes work really good. Because I could turn my blinker off, huh? folks I'm gonna turn the brights on for a bit see it see how our charging system holds up I know it doesn't like them Woo. yeah it'd be nice to have a speedometer right now But, like I said, I didn't really have time. This thing does turn, like the suspension's tight as crap. You gotta be careful not to overturn. I'll 
go back this way. And I, I think uh, it makes me a little nervous with no uh, review mirrors. I need review mirrors. Turn in this corner, like it's like you could feel like the G's or some shit. Like I don't know about G's, but you could. It's like totally like it's weird when you're not leaning, just leaning on. It's, it's weird. There's a, some roadkill, huh? There is a little bit of vibration, but nothing crazy. This cruise is real nice though. You can hear the bell kind of like, sounds like a supercharger or something. The CVT, cause it's got a, like an open, open case back there. This is a cool little road though for this. No cars behind us. This little uh, like train track right here, going underneath it. We used to throw like pu pumpkins and uh, random other stuff late at night when we were in high school. You know, being hoodlums. the trike a wrap I do have a few little things to button up um, I, I appreciate everybody that left positive comments on this build series it's nice to see those Just, YouTube can be such a negative place but this trike really has gotten a lot of like honest good um, reviews good vibes things like that really appreciate that if it wasn't for the YouTube community building my channel up I would have never had the opportunity to build that which was super fun and uh, Adam, he's the owner, thank you for the uh, opportunity. Um, he also has the Grom clone, so I'm going to be finishing that. But this, it was a success. I appreciate it, and we'll see you in the next build.